In this video, let us find the length of the shortest path between two given points of a cube. Let A and B be the ends of the longest diagonal of the unit cube. The length of the shortest path from A to B along the surface is A root 3, B 1 plus root 2, C root 5 or D 3. Solution Given a cube with side 1 unit, join AB. Mark points C, D, X, Y and Z on the cube as shown in figure 1. Given that AB is one of the longest diagonals of the given cube, let us try to draw every distant path along the surface from A to B and check whether we can arrive at a single answer by eliminating the other options. Path 1 is that from A to B via C as shown in figure 2. Length of this path equals length of AC plus length of BC. Length of AC equals 1 unit. We are required to find the length of BC. By applying Pythagoras theorem on triangle CDB, we obtain CB square equals CD square plus DB square. That is 1 square plus 1 square which equals 2. That is CB equals root 2 units. Hence, the length of this path equals 1 plus root 2. Path 2 is that from A to B via P as shown in figure 3. Let P be the midpoint of side Zx. Consequently, Pz equals half and Px equals half. Length of this path equals length of AP plus length of PB. Thus, we have to find the lengths of AP and PB. Applying Pythagoras theorem on triangle AXP, we obtain AP square equals AX square plus PX square. That is, 1 square plus half square which equals 5 by 4. That is AP equals root 5 by 4 which equals root 5 by 2 units. Similarly, applying Pythagoras theorem on right triangle PZB, we obtain PB equals root 5 by 2 units. Hence, the length of path APB equals root 5 by 2 plus root 5 by 2. That is root 5. Now, we have an obvious doubt about the shortest path among the two paths. It is not easy to find the value of root 5 and 1 plus root 2 without a calculator as we are unaware of the value of root 5 and root 2. Therefore, let us try to compare the square values of both the expressions. Root 5 square equals 5. 1 plus root 2 square equals 1 plus 2 plus 2 root 2, which equals 3 plus 2 root 2. Now, let us analyze logically whether 3 plus 2 root 2 is greater than 5 or not. Consider 3 plus 2 root 2. Value of root 2 is definitely greater than 1. Any number greater than 1 when multiplied with 2 gives a product greater than 2. 3 added to a number greater than 2 gives a sum greater than 5. Thus, 3 plus 2 root 2 is greater than 5. That is, 1 plus root 2 the whole square is greater than root 5 the whole square, which implies 1 plus root 2 is greater than root 5. Thus, we can eliminate the options B and D. Among the answer options, the value of option A, that is root 3, is less than that of root 5. Hence, we have to eliminate one of them for finding the length of the shortest path. For that, let us find the length of diagonal AB. Applying Pythagoras theorem on the right triangle AYB, we get AB square equals AY square plus BY square, which equals root 2 square plus 1 square, that is 2 plus 1, which equals 3. Thus, we get AB equals root 3 units. From figure 1, 
it is clear that the length of any path along the surface is greater than the longest diagonal AB. That is, any path along the surface is greater than root 3 units. So, option A can be eliminated. Thus, root 5 is the length of the shortest path. The, the right answer to the question is option C. Hope you all like this video. For more videos and update on the upcoming free classes, you can be part of a WhatsApp group and Telegram group. To be part of the WhatsApp group, you can just text to this number and to be part of the Telegram group and Telegram channel, you can just search Christie's classes in Telegram. In the Telegram group, daily live free quizzes happen at 9 p.m. on general aptitude. You can be part of that quiz also. And if you want live free classes for general aptitude, you can download an academy mobile application and search this profile Christy Burgess and you can see 300 plus pre-recorded videos and upcoming daily live classes happen at 11 a.m. Monday to Friday 11 a.m. free classes happen in this profile. So you are welcome to attend this free classes also and more YouTube video details are given here. And these are the details of the full courses or the paid courses in an academy platform which you can get by taking an academy plus subscription with the referral code CC10. Hope to see you in the upcoming video. Thank you.